Greetings, this is Brandon with Primarily Pens. Today I have the David Osterson Take It to the Limit Fountain Pen. My first video review was on this pen, and I did it while holding the pen in one hand and the camera in the other. My process, as well as my camera and audio, has improved since then, so I wanted to have another go at it. I'll slip in a few remakes between new reviews. The Take It to the Limit collection has six primary color variations with 100 pens each in either fountain or rollerball. Starting at the top, we have a gear selection diagram with opaque black enamel. Looking at the side, the clip is an elongated piston. The cap has images of the engine controls cluster with engine temperature, tachometer, oil temp, speedometer, and fuel gauge. The signature feature of this pen is the background galoche. David Osterson was able to engrave a carbon fiber pattern that looks amazing. At first glance, it absolutely looks like real carbon fiber weave. The band has David Osterson's name, silver hallmarks, and a P for prototype. This is the first example produced by David Osterson. The barrel has more of the wonderful carbon fiber galoche with a racing stripe and a racing number one. The bottom is finished off with opaque black enamel. The body shape is the same as the recent Nikola Tesla and the 15th anniversary Art Deco with a slightly conical cap, straight barrel with a slight taper at the end. The pen weighs in at 88 grams. Opening up the pen, you have an 18 karat gold nib with the Osterson logo. The grip has a wonderful quote from the legendary Mario Andretti. If everything seems under control, you're just not going fast enough. Gotta love it. The engravings provide just enough grip to keep it from being slippery. It is cartridge converter filled and can also be eyedropper filled. Taking a quick look at the packaging material, we have the outer box and a nicely finished wooden box with the Osterson name. It comes with polishing cloth, certificate, and brochure with the descriptions of David Osterson's limited editions. This insert shows some of the color variations. Well, there you have it. The David Osterson Take It to the Limit. The carbon fiber galoche pattern is simply amazing. A great pen for the car enthusiast. Please leave comments below. Take a look at my other reviews and subscribe to Primarily Pens. I'll have additional reviews soon.